As Greg and John settled back into their celebrity master chef judging personas, the new group of celebrities struggled to get to grips with building their dishes. Tonight's premiere episode gave viewers three tense challenges based on each of the contestants' SS. But the final moments of the show saw the each of the celebs lined up to learn who had been booted off in the first week. After a tough week for comedian Keith Allen, he looked to be the first on the chopping block for the series. However unbeknownst to him BBC reporter Michelle Eckerly was also having some issues of her own. While she found it increasingly difficult to serve her scallops during the restaurant phase of the episode, the final run was even worse. Michelle also didn't deliver in her fish pie recipe, which Greg found himself digging through to find any pieces of fish. As the final moments of the episode arrived, Greg and John announced that Michelle was to be the first to leave the show. Michelle congratulated all of her peers for getting through to the next round, but as she hugged Keith he quipped, Well, I'm not surprised. Obviously joking, Michelle laughed before leaving the show for good. Michelle went on to say that she was going out with a smile on my face. She also told the team, I wish the rest of the guys the best of luck. Keith also chimed in one last time to say, until Michelle's potato was airlifted and I thought it was taxi cab for Mr. Allen. Earlier on in the show fans were delighted by the staggering height difference between Greg and rugby player Martin Bayfield. As Greg arrived at Martin's table he inquired, for a big guy you look a little nervous. And fans were utterly elated by the height difference, with one writing, WHO shrunk Greg Wallace. Celebrity Mr. Kef. Another said, honey, I shrunk the green grocer. Celebrity Mr. Kef. Greg looking up at Martin Bayfield. A third chimed in. The pair also found it funny as they quipped about looking up at each other. Celebrity Mr. Kef continues tomorrow at 8.30pm on BBC One.